Morgan friends, don't you just love these wonderful, hope-filled words recorded in the Bible? The people who walk in darkness will see a great light, a light that will shine on all who live in the land where death casts its shadow. They're echoed in, the, in Luke's gospel by Zechariah, the father of John the Baptist. Because of God's tender mercy, the light from heaven is about to break upon us to give light to those who sit in darkness and in the shadow of death and to guide us to the path of peace. Life can get dark at various times, troubles, sorrows, pressures. But what I know is that in the deepest, darkest times in my life, God has always been there, ready to shine a light into the dark places of my soul and guide me to a path of peace. I'm 100% convinced that God is still here with us today and ready to do the same for us today, no matter how difficult and heavy things feel in our hearts. Although we may not have recognized it so far, the voice of God is tenderly calling out to us and pursuing us with his love. How do we welcome God's wonderful light into our darkness? The Bible tells us, but you dear friends, by building yourselves up in your most holy faith and praying in the Holy Spirit, keep yourselves in God's love as you wait for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ to bring you to eternal life. So Heavenly Father, here we are today coming to you for light and hope in our journey. When we're weak, help us to remember to build ourselves up by simply praying and keeping ourselves in your love as we wait. I bless anyone struggling to do that today, God, that you will strengthen them to hope and to reach out to you. Help them to receive your mercy and love, even if they don't understand how it all works. Help them to simply trust you and say, Lord, you are merciful to people like me. I receive your love and comfort. Make me strong in your love right now. Lord, I pray for significant breakthroughs for many today who are troubled and feeling like they're in a dark place. Break through with your tender mercy and bring hope and healing. Fill them up with your goodness and help them to know what a good, good father you are to those who put their trust in you. Amen. Well, let's welcome God's wonderful light today. <laughs>